back then, after being mummified, they believed that you would be sent to the world of my aunt, also known as an underworld. It was filled with creatures and evil snakes and p snakes and monsters. You're supposed to try and get past that, and if you do, you would be judged by 45 gods. You'd have to present yourself with the god with by their name and, and tell them that you never made anyone cry, never was an eavesdropper, or never polluted anything. And after all that, you you get to the next part, heart, which is the weighing of the heart. If your heart weighs less than a feather, you're innocent. But if your heart weighs more than the ostrich feather, you, your heart gets eaten by Ahmed, the soul eater. So that then you won't cease to live forever. So then they weigh your heart, and if it's pure, Ra, the son of Light brings you down to the underworld, or Osiris. Osiris accepts you in the underworld. Then you get to meet with all the other reincarnations. There's a lot to work, a lot of work to be done. No, there's no sadness or anger here. Just planting reeds infinitely and infinitely. It continuously, continuously. There's a lot of work to be done. And obviously that didn't happen because I was mummified and I'm right here. <laughs> so that's about all there is to it. There's a little more, but...